Hey guys, it's Lynn with Little Foot Nursery. I just wanted to show you guys some close-ups of uh, baby Madeline because that box opening, I was watching back the video and uh, it ended up being a little bit far away. So I know it was a little hard to see all the details. Um, sorry, I didn't have a chance to catch this on camera, but we went ahead and changed her into this cute little yellow knit that she came with. And I think I put, had put the hat incorrectly. <laughs> <laughs> the first time in the video so I went ahead and um, I'm gonna put her in this cute little yellow knit and she's got her yellow pants and her belly plate um, yeah so let me just go ahead and remove the knit hat so you guys can see the details of her hair and, um, and I'll hopefully put her into a new outfit at some point probably off camera because I haven't yet being able to figure out how to, I probably need to get a taller tripod because this little one really keeps wobbling. I was trying to put it on the bed and it kept falling, so sorry about that. Anyway, she's got really beautiful rooted hair. Um, yeah, I just, I just think she's amazing. She's just very detailed. I'm also gonna take off the yellow knit so you can just see, you can just see her in a diaper with her belly plate. She can be a little naked baby. Um, and then we can kind of zoom in on some of her details. Oh my gosh, she's just, she looks so real, you guys. <laughs> I love her. Oh my gosh. And you know, it was funny because like when I ordered her, I envisioned her being um, really, you know, kind of a, a little buddy to my Clara, but she's really quite a bit bigger as a baby. Oh my gosh, her hair is so soft. <sighs> Melissa really did a wonderful job on her. Let me take a look at her rooted hair. Let's see the swirl. Um, let's see her little hands. Aww. <laughs> I can't look at hands. Sorry there. Got her palms. Got her little fingertips. Oh my gosh, and um, you can see the subtle veining in Motley. She's got a really beautiful skin tone. And cute little feet. You can see the details in terms of tipping the toenails. Um, yeah, but when she's like sideways and she's got the belly plate, you know, she really looks so real with that belly plate on. <laughs> And, you know, guys, this is the first doll that I've actually owned with a belly plate. This is actually my first experience with belly plates. I do have um, another baby on custom order from a different artist actually coming, uh, hopefully in the upcoming weeks. And that baby will actually have the full vinyl torso. But I'm going to, I'm actually purchasing that baby as a painted kit so I can just save a little bit of money and assemble her myself. And I'm probably going to cut that vinyl torso in two because for me, the cuddle factor on my babies is so key. And I, I just don't think cuddling a hard piece of vinyl is going to be um, as, as enjoyable. But yeah, she, here's baby Madeline. She is looking so cute. Um, and I'm actually going to, I'm going to go ahead and get her sister, Clara, um, since of course all my babies would be her sister, but um, I'm grabbing Clara real quick. I'm just going to put them side by side for a comparison. Oh, oh my gosh, they're so cute together. Okay, let me see if I can actually arrange them differently. Um, let's see if I can put Madeline on this side. And then put Clara on this side. Oh my goodness. Oh, look at that. <laughs> Oh my gosh, how cute are they? Look at that. Oh my goodness, you guys, look. You know, it's funny, I, I guess, yeah, I think they're both supposedly 18 inches, 18 inch babies, but you see how Clara, who is my Levi sculpt, just looks so much shorter. She looks like, and she looks and feels like just a much smaller baby. But it's really interesting because I know that in, uh, Matt, Madeline, who's my angel sculpt, she, um, 
you know, on the McPherson's website said she would be 18 inches, but yeah, she actually looks quite a bit bigger. So I'm going to stand up and zoom out a little bit so you guys can see. But yeah, look at that. It is, oh, they are super cute together though. Yeah, I had asked Melissa, um, because Madeline was a custom. I just really love this little sculpt. I love, um, I, I think, I think Bonnie Sieben is a very talented sculptor. Also, of course, love Bonnie Brown, like so many, so many people in the, the community do, but oh, look at that. But yeah, they, they have just a different feel to them. Um, Clara is very pale. She has blonde hair. Um, and then we have Madeline here who's more, who's brunette. Her, her coloring is a little bit stronger and more vivid really love them both and yeah and um i actually have <laughs> believe it or not um a couple other customs in the queue with melissa so she is going to be making me a couple more babies so because i do not yet trust myself to paint the more expensive kits and i don't um yeah so i i, I want to make sure that they're done just to perfection so uh, I, I will not stop buying dolls from other artists, even though I am painting my own. But anyway, just wanted to say hi to you guys and just give you a few more details um, on this cute little girl and show her in her belly plate and in her diaper. <laughs> and she just looks so cute right now. I am so smitten. Um, anyway, I am going to get going with my day. Um, I think... I might be going to Disneyland. So, all right. Uh, hope you guys have a fantastic Saturday and see you on the next video.